Hey y'all, thank you so much for taking the time. Come over here and visit with me. Over on Fritz's Cooking again. I'm Fritz, and tonight, guys, I reckon it's uh, another uh, Sunday night cook for us, guys. And uh, I'm gonna do something really simple tonight, guys. I haven't, uh, I've been lazy. I haven't had the chance to get to the grocery store. And uh, we actually like having breakfast for dinner here every now and then as well. So basically what I wanted to actually show you in, in particular on this video is the way I do my scrambled eggs. I know a lot of people have different techniques and methods of doing it, and I was just going to share mine with you all as well. But uh, okay, guys, we're going to have some scrambled eggs. We've got some bacon here. I've got uh, some leftover sausage here. I've got some Spam. I love Spam. And I've got some uh, frozen uh, Pillsbury biscuits. And, of course, we got our standby, our grits here. I love grits. But, uh, all right, guys, let me get after this, and we'll get right back to you. I can't thank you enough for watching. Okay, y'all, thanks okay, so much. Okay, guys, we got our bacon going. we got another pan out here. We're getting ready to get started on our sausage here. Um, we've got our oven uh, preheated to 375 degrees for our, our frozen Pillsbury biscuits. And, guys, I'm actually going to go ahead and get my uh, Spam cut up here. And I like to use this little chopper thing here, and it actually gives me, like, pretty much uniform cuts with the Spam. But uh, let's go ahead and get this puppy out. And I don't know if y'all have ever... You know, kind of fought this stuff before trying to get it out of the uh, can, but I'll just merely kind of open it up a little bit, like so. Get a little air in there and then just pop it right on out. All right, guys, like I said, I like using this thing and I can get pretty good uniform cuts with it. So. All right, guys, easy peasy. All right, y'all, let me get out. Okay, guys, let's get our old folks sausage cut up here, Al Pernell. We actually, this is actually Kentucky sausage here. It's good stuff. I always put mine in a cold pan and I get the burner going over here. But uh Go ahead and pull the remainder out of the tube here. Another good technique guys is <clears throat> actually like uh you know, uh, freezing it just a little bit, you know, not where it's completely frozen solid, but enough where you can cut it. You can actually cut out some, you know, real, real small pieces if you want, or skinny pieces. Guys, we are good to go. All right, we'll get right back to you. If you get a little shell in there, you can actually use the shell to get the shell out. Pretty cool. Sausage is done. So let's go ahead and get that plated up and we'll keep that warm. We'll let our spam go just for another minute or so. I like mine a little crunchy.
All right, guys, guys, I almost forgot my Eggos, man. Can't have uh, uh, breakfast for dinner without Eggos now. And I got uh, Thick and Fluffy, original recipe. I love these things, guys. We go ahead and get these guys, in the oven. getting ready to show you how to do uh, scrambled eggs Fritz's way, Fern Creek style. And uh, this is the method to my madness. Um, I get my uh, burner on as high a temperature as I can get it. I get it rolling. I get where there's almost smoke coming off that uh, bacon grease right there. Uh, a lot of guys and gals out there will take and they'll whip them up and they'll put milk in them or cream or whatever and uh, and I'm sure that's fantastic. My mom does it like that a lot of, a lot of times as well. But uh, I simply, no, no salt, no pepper, no nothing. I get this thing rolling and it's smoking good right now and I let my whites set up. As soon as I, my eggs hit, off the temperature, off the temperature. And I'll let them egg whites get good and set, almost like burning, sort of, you know. This is just the way my father used to make it, and I, and I really loved it. So, all right, guys, now we're ready to get scaring with Piece of cake. Look how fast those scrambled eggs are done. Now I'm telling you guys, it might look weird, but I'm telling you, they taste fantastic. And the key is about that bacon grease in there. All right, guys, the eggs 101, they're done. Piece of cake. Okay, guys, we got our Sunday night feast over to the table, our breakfast for dinner, if you will. And I've got mom plated up, and uh, we've got our Eggo waffles, we've got our biscuits. Um, I've got my, 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 the way I do my scrambled eggs, we've got some grits some, with some butter, some Spam, some bacon, and some sausage. All right, guys, let me get after this, see, see what it tastes like. All right, guys, we are ready to rock. Look at that. Ain't that a fan, fine looking uh, breakfast plate right there? This is Southern style, baby. The only thing I'm really lacking is some, uh, some gravy, some red eye gravy. And <laughs> but anyway, guys, let's get after it. I'll go ahead and I'll, I'll, I love me some grits, guys. So let me go ahead and get into my grits here. And I always eat my grits with my eggs. So I'll get over here and get me a little bit of eggs and my grits. Mm-mm-mm. Mmm. Mmm. A little biscuit. Mmm. Piece of sausage. Oh yeah, guys, that's downtown. Mm-mm-mm. Mmm-mm. Get a little bit of this ego. Let go of my ego. Oh yeah, these are the thick ones. I like these. Mmm. Oh yeah, guys, it's next levelness. Oh yeah. Give me some of my chocolate milk wash it down with. Oh yeah guys, that is next levelness. Mm mm mm. Get after some more of these grits. Get some of these eggs. I'm telling you guys, that is downtown now. Mmm. A piece of spam. Mmm. Guys, I gotta get after this. Mmm. I'll tell you what, y'all, I, I can always say, you know, I can't thank y'all enough for, for coming by and, and watching my videos and spending some time with me and visiting with me and 
I just wanted to say thank you so very much. It means the world to me, and I appreciate all the friendship and, and all the fellowship that we've made on here. And uh, I'm hoping that y'all will come back and watch with me every Sunday. And, uh, guys, this is fantastic. I, I'm going to get to it. But I uh, just want to say thank you so very much, and we will holler at y'all soon. Later, guys. Bye.